Development is complicated. A country's development is often measured with two groups taken into consideration. These groups are economic development and social development. In this video, I will explain what development is and how it is measured. When measuring economic development, there are four indices that must be taken into consideration. The advantages of using these factors as indicators of development are that it makes countries easily comparable and are easy to understand, giving us a good indication of the overall wealth of a country. Although the indicators do not tell the full story, they can often leave major details of a country's development untouched. Factors such as currency fluctuations, distribution and inequality of wealth, and government spending on public goods can be disguised by these indicators. Unpaid labour is also left unnoticed and there is often a struggle to obtain accurate information. These indicators, therefore, are a measure of only what is produced and paid for. Social development indicators are used to assess how well a country is developing in key areas, such as health, education and diet. There are hundreds of social development indicators, but we are going to look at four. There are several advantages to these social indices. For example, they illustrate the potential development of a country's living standards. They can also give us an indication of the quality of the government. These indices also have a wider measure of development than economic indicators, and they are objective and measurable. These indices are also reliable indicators for assessing the general welfare of people in a country, especially children. Although there are still negatives to these development indicators. Data from some developing countries may not be very reliable and may be difficult to confirm. As well as this, similar to the criticism of GDP, it often doesn't measure unequal distribution within a country. And in terms of literacy rates, there is no indication in the education index about access to education for all groups in society.